Welcome everyone. In this video, we are going to see how you will install Notepad++ on your Mac. Let me let me show you what is my Mac version. So you will see this is Apple M2 chip and I am using Mac OS Sonoma. So let me close these windows and I will now open the Notepad++. I will go to the search and note Notepad. So I have installed Notepad++ on my this latest Mac. So how you will install that? So let's watch the video. Click on this link and you will go to the GitHub repository. In GitHub repository, you will find each and everything you need. So click open that link in new tab. Now you will see porting kit and on the left side download, you can download this. Porting kit 632 I am storing in notepad plus plus I have created folders once it is download it is 126 MB so once you download double click on it porting kit drag and drop to your application and you will turn now you can close all these folders which is there you will see in the application we have porting kit so we can close that close porting kit and also close download folder now click on open now it will take some time set, set up porting kit so wait for it and now click continue porting kit continue you will see now sunday 28 july click continue now you have to read the license agreement click continue here we have to provide the folder permission so i am allowing porting kit to access my download access allow now also click here and say allow now click continue analytical continue this is the path where application will install now because this is optional gogo.com so i am not clicking on it if you want you can click now click start now say ok welcome to porting kit click on ok once you click on ok button you will see all apps and in all apps we will able to see what are the free versions of porting kit we can use you can also refresh from the top so you will see free application is there so notepad is also there so click on notepad install now it will ask install notepad plus plus on mac os right so now click on next introduction it will provide some so okay we'll also close this so introduction agreement next advanced setting next requirement destiny select install i'm installing on default path updating winsky master wrapper it will install 62 mb so i will speed up the process once it is download we'll again come back and install that so now we have 60 mb already downloaded so let's wait a couple of seconds it will download all the wrapper preparation and updating winsky master wrapper so just wait a couple of seconds now it is downloading ws121 c x6 64 bit so it will also 159 mb so now it is creating wrapper now extracting engine ws12 wine so again we have to wait for some time this is very easy step uh, once you watch this video you don't have to watch any other video now it's verifying notepad and uh, if again let me show you at the start of video we have seen but it is downloading so meanwhile again i will show you so click on that now you'll see 14.5 mac os sonoma version so let's close that and now it is creating prefix notepad after that okay creating win prefix again it will download 196 mb so for once you uh, do with porting kit so you don't have to do anything it's uh, do uh, all the things in the background from his end so now we have downloaded uh, gstream it is uh, near to completion 195 mb it's completed now you will see okay now we have 196 mb click ok once uh, here we have to type our laptop password so type laptop password click ok now okay pre-configuring port 
for notepad plus plus just wait uh, even in your scenario maybe it will take some time it is depend upon internet speed so most of the time whenever it is taking uh, time so i'm uh, streaming the trim the video okay now we have running okay now we come to this screen that means we are installing non notepad plus plus okay it is 8.4.6 version click next if you want to change uh, path you can change only uh, 11 or 12 mb it is required available space is 26 click next install i am clicking on create shortcut on desktop install now click on finish because we have downloaded old version so it's give update available so let's also install updated version click yes it will again download latest uh, 8.6.9 notepad plus plus version okay so once it is uh, completed again we it will show steps to download notepad plus plus again now click yes notepad plus plus update now we have to follow same steps again now click ok next i agree next next create uh, even it is not show install in porting kit we will able to see finish now in if we go to the application we will able to see our notepad plus plus now what we'll do we will create two file and save both the file in desktop so let's try hi okay now open notepad plus plus you will see notepad plus plus is there now let's open it and write something and open another let's write this is first view and go to another and type this is another view okay let's write another view and you just go here move close and another screen so this is the very uh, fantastic thing i love about notepad plus plus we have two different uh, views uh, even let's try to save the file so i am saving my file in my desktop which is 2024 if you observe i have uh, in the desktop youtube one and click on save save another file as well file click on save and then give uh, extension will be dot txt now give youtube to dot txt save now close that and go back to 2024 and we will able to see the file okay youtube one youtube two so if you like this video make sure to subscribe to my channel like my video share with your friend colleagues whatever and uh, yeah th that will make me motivate to create more content on youtube and if you reach to this screen thanks a lot